let's look at GGPE B5. You can see by the board the word slope in every part of this objective. It talks about prove the slope criteria for parallel and perpendicular lines. Use those to solve geometric problems. Very open-ended again, but I think we've done enough of these kinds of things to know what this looks like. So this is really about uh, establishing the, the characteristics of parallel lines. Normally this is a given, but with our transformational approach, you and I can actually prove that slopes must be equal off of a coordinate system or on a coordinate system. Either way works just fine. Again, you can do the same thing for perpendicular, prove that they're negative reciprocals of each other. And then, of course, use that to come up with equations of lines, to find the equation of a perpendicular bisector, to um, look at a tangent line equation, those kinds of things. A nice mix of uh, review with the current stuff we've been learning. Uh, be able to obviously determine slope, and then also, as similar to the last objective, classify things based off of slope. I actually slide this objective right in front of that other one because to be able to do coordinate proof and some of those things you need to have a good handle on slope and so this comes first. So uh, what are the traps and pitfalls? Kind of similarly to the last one, just uh, it's, a, it's a strong review of the algebra. Students need to know the equation of lines. They need to know different formats of those whether that be point slope or slope intercept or standard form and just be very comfortable with equations of lines and, and using them to solve problems.